What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you guys how to get the new Halo weapons in the 30th anniversary update. So once you load in, you're going to be inside of this mission called the Dares of Eternity. So basically, after some of the encounters, a chest will spawn and that is where you get the weapons from. As you can see here, I finished, and I actually got a lot of loot, but sadly, no new weapons. But, you see those treasure keys, you can actually open a chest that is located at Xur, and I'll show you guys how to do that right now. You can also get these weapons by acquiring these, these um, treasure keys right here and opening that chest all the way up here. Some of the weapons you will get will be the retrace path, a new trace rifle, and this is a legendary trace rifle, the first one in the game, and this one is actually from Halo. The next weapon you will get is the Half Truths. This is another sword that is actually from Halo. And once again, another Halo weapon. This is the BXR-55 Battler. This is a pulse rifle. And this is a new archetype of pulse rifles that's never been in the game before. It is called the Legacy PR-55 Frame. Basically what this frame does is customized frame which dramatically increased accuracy, stability, and targeting while firing from the hip. So, in Halo you fire from the hip, so that's why they made this insane hip fire accuracy. From those chests you can also get this Wastelander M5 shotgun. This is a lightweight frame, so it's great for Crucible. And I haven't got this shotgun yet, but I've heard it is insane. Pardon our dust, this is a grenade launcher. It is legendary rarity. And again, I have not got this gun either. Finally, for those of you who have played D1, you know what this weapon is. The Thousand Yard Stare, an adaptive frame sniper, and this thing is crazy in Crucible. You guys should definitely try to get yourself a good roll on this. For PvP, you definitely want Snapshot. Now for the exotics. This exotic is called the Forerunner, it is a sidearm, and this is another Halo weapon. This is actually the pistol you get, and this gun looks pretty cool. It has max range, almost max reload speed, high stability, high handling. I feel like this is going to be crazy. And the gun everybody has been waiting for, the one and only Gallahorn. This is an exotic rocket launcher, but the only thing is you have to pay for the 30th anniversary pack to get this gun. So sadly, I did not pick up the 30th anniversary pack. That is it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoy the 30th anniversary, and I hope you guys have fun grinding for those god rolls on the Halo weapons and even the other weapons. So, peace.